We previously discussed the discovery of Comet 3i ATLAS, only the third interstellar object ever observed after Oumuamua and Borisov. Soon after its detection, bold claims emerged suggesting it might not be a comet at all, but something artificial, even alien. The idea made headlines, but NASA quickly stepped in and firmly dismissed it, presenting clear evidence. In this video, we'll explore why those claims spread so quickly, how NASA unraveled the mystery, and what 3i slash ATLAS really reveals about the hidden chemistry of other solar systems. The story began on July 1st, 2025, when the asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, ATLAS, in Chile, detected a faint object racing across the night sky. Calculations of its orbit showed something remarkable. It wasn't bound to the sun. Instead, its path was hyperbolic, confirming it had come from outside our solar system. Astronomers quickly named it 3i slash ATLAS, the 3i marking it as the third interstellar object ever discovered. Estimates suggested it could be between a few hundred meters and several kilometers across, traveling at over 200,000 kilometers per hour, faster than any other known interstellar visitor. For most scientists, this made it an exciting research target. Studying its chemistry and behavior promised new insights into how planets and comets form in other star systems. But Avi Loeb, director of the Galileo Project at Harvard, offered a very different interpretation. Writing in a scientific paper and blog post, Loeb pointed to the object's early lack of a visible tail and its somewhat unusual trajectory. He suggested that if the comet continued to show no outgassing, or if it altered its course while behind the sun, it could be evidence of something artificial, perhaps a technological artifact launched deliberately. Loeb even raised the possibility, at least hypothetically, that such an object might have malign intent. At the same time, he admitted the simpler explanation was that it was a natural comet, stressing that his proposal was an intellectual exercise meant to keep science open to radical possibilities. Still, the mention of alien technology ensured headlines. For the second time in less than a decade, the world was debating whether an interstellar visitor might be more than just rock and ice. NASA, however, quickly stepped in with its own assessment, and it was far more grounded. NASA scientists examined three i atlas with ground-based observatories, the Hubble Space Telescope, and the James Webb Space Telescope. Their findings were consistent. The object behaves like a comet. Tom Statler, NASA's lead scientist for small bodies, summarized it plainly. It looks like a comet. It does comet things. And the evidence overwhelmingly points to it being a comet. As the comet approached the sun, astronomers observed the development of a coma and tail, produced when sunlight warmed its icy surface and released gas and dust. Spectroscopic analysis revealed the presence of water ice and carbon dioxide, with an unusually high ratio of CO2 to H2O compared to typical solar system comets. The dust grains also reflected light differently, giving it a unique polarization signature. None of this suggested alien design. Only the natural diversity expected of comets formed in other stellar environments. Importantly, NASA dismissed any idea that the comet could threaten Earth. Its closest approach will be about 1.8 astronomical units, or 170 million miles away. Its trajectory is well understood and includes passes by Mars, Jupiter, and Venus, all at safe distances. It also reminded the public that anomalies in cometary behavior are common. Even in our own solar system, comets can suddenly brighten or fade as ice pockets collapse or release dust in unpredictable ways. Unusual traits are not evidence of artificial origin. They are part of the normal physics of icy bodies. By presenting a clear body of evidence, it dismantled the alien hypothesis. Instead, they highlighted the scientific opportunity, a chance to study pristine interstellar material up close. For the agency, the real headline is not speculation about extraterrestrial technology, 
but the fact that astronomers are now able to detect, track, and analyze visitors from beyond the solar system in unprecedented detail. So if 3I-ATLAS is not alien technology, why is it important? Because interstellar comets are windows into other worlds. Each one carries the chemical and physical fingerprints of the environment where it formed. For it, the dominance of carbon dioxide suggests it originated in an extremely cold region of its home system, farther from its parent star than most comets here. If, as some studies propose, it came from the Milky Way's thick disk, it could be over 7 billion years old, predating the birth of our solar system. That makes it more than just a curiosity. It is a preserved fragment of another planetary nursery, drifting through space for eons before crossing our path. Studying it expands our understanding of how solar systems form and evolve across the galaxy. Observations also show that it differs from both previous interstellar objects. Oumuamua had no visible coma, sparking years of debate. Borisov, on the other hand, looked very much like a standard comet. Atlas falls somewhere in between. It behaves like a comet, but with distinctive chemical ratios and light properties that make it stand out. This diversity is exactly what excites astronomers. By comparing these rare objects, scientists can test whether the processes that shaped our solar system are typical or unique. Every new interstellar visitor becomes another piece of a much larger puzzle. The controversy itself also highlights how science works. Loeb's proposal shows the value of questioning assumptions and entertaining bold ideas. NASA's rebuttal shows the equal importance of rigorous data and cautious interpretation. Together, they demonstrate that speculation and evidence both play roles, but only evidence can settle the case. With modern telescopes, astronomers can now prepare for these encounters in ways that were impossible just a decade ago. Coordinated campaigns across observatories mean that every detail, from gas composition to dust scattering, can be captured and studied. Comet 3i slash ATLAS isn't alien technology. It's a natural interstellar comet, shedding gas and dust as it speeds past. The real story isn't science fiction, but the science itself. A rare glimpse of material from another star system. Want more deep space discoveries explained clearly? Subscribe and stay tuned. The universe always has another surprise.